Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2023. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create text around a circle. I will also show you how to animate the rotation so it just spins around. The first thing I did was add some text. So come up to the top toolbar. If you double click on the type tool, that'll put the cursor right in the center of your composition. Just type out some text that you want on the circle. And the font that I'm using for this example is called Landrina Solid. Select the text layer in the layers panel. Then go up to the shape tool. I'm going to click and hold and select the ellipse tool. I'll press the shift key so I have a perfect circle. I'm just going to draw out a circle. I can press the space bar to move the circle around in position. But when I'm happy with the size, I'm just going to let go. Now go down to the layers panel and twirl open the type layer. Twirl open text. Twirl open path options. Next to path, there's a drop down menu. Select that and change it from none to mask one. And now the text is around the circular mask. Pretty cool. So currently the text is inside the circular mask and I want it to go on the outside. To do so, we're gonna go down to reverse path and change it from off to on. For my example, I'm gonna copy and paste this text to fill out the circle. So first, I'm just gonna double click on the text layer. That's gonna highlight all the text. I'll press Command or Control C to copy. I'll put my cursor at the end and press Command V. And that'll paste in the text so it's gonna fill out the circle. I'm missing a couple bullet points, so I'm gonna press the space bar. Option eight on the Mac will add the bullet point. And now it's just a matter of fine tuning it. Maybe I'll just increase the size of the font a little bit. Okay, and now it's time to animate the text. So twirl open the type layer, twirl open text, path options, and go to first margin. Now you can animate this using keyframes, but I'm just gonna use a simple expression. So press the option key on a Mac, alt on Windows, and click on the stopwatch for first margin. I'll type out time, T-I-M-E, asterisk, so that's shift eight. I'm just gonna enter in a value of 150. I'll click off, tap the space bar, if you want to slow down the animation, just enter a smaller number. So I'll type in 75. To speed up, enter a bigger number. And if you want to reverse the direction, you can just enter in a minus sign before any of your values. So if I type in minus 75, that's going to go in the reverse direction. And now let's add that inner shape circle. So first, make sure nothing is selected in the layers panel. You can just click on any empty space or a really handy keyboard shortcut to know is F2. That will deselect all. Then come up to the shape tool. I'm just gonna click and select the ellipse tool. Click on the color swatch for stroke. Pick a color and change the stroke size. Mine is set to 13 pixels. I'll press the shift key to have a perfect circle. I use the space bar to move it around in position and then let go. I'll use the align panel to make sure they're aligned in the center. So I'll select both layers, go to the align panel. First, I'll go to selection and just center them, then go to composition and we're good to go. And that is how to add text around a circle or any path. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.